Hello! Hi! I, um... No more brapping in the chat. Mods, can we ban that? No more brapping. Uh, hello! Welcome back to the Kirby is a Nerd stream. Today we're going to be playing King of Fighters 15. We were supposed to be playing Street Fighter 6, but when I opened it, I started smelling smoke in my room, and it wasn't coming from me. So I thought, Oh, that might be a bad sign. So instead, we're going to play Ryu from Streets' his longtime competitor, Terry Bogard from Smash Brothers. When I set our category to King of King of Fighters 15, I saw that one of the other streams under King of Fighters as a category was playing Guilty Gear Strive instead. That's all I have to say about that. Terry is short for Terald. You could say that. I'm, I suppose nothing could stop you from saying that. 
I can't prove that you're wrong or anything. I'll take your word for it. Terold Bogard. So yeah, I... King of Fighters is a video game that I have not played a lot of. I like King of Fighters a lot. I love to watch King of Fighters. But these mechanical hands have not put as much time into King of Fighters as I may have liked to. So today is going to be a learning experience for all of us. Well, maybe not for you, but for me, definitely. We're going to go into the crossplay beta, and we're going to do some play, some online ranked matches. And we're going to try our best to figure this out. Luckily, King of Fighters is very well optimized. So I doubt we'll have many hardware limitations. The only hardware limitations we'll have to worry about is my CPU failing to process what's going on. Let's get this thing open. Thank you for the pats and chat. Hopefully this isn't incredibly loud upon opening. So yeah, this is the beta test version of King of Fighters. Thank you for more pats, chat. Thank you. This is a place of love and kindness. <laughs> Whoa. The King of Fighters 15. <laughs> you got a hand there, chat. So I did play a little bit before stream today, just to make sure that the game would run. I don't know why the main menu theme is... Do you, do you think Terold would eat Burger King? Absolutely. He would definitely eat Burger King. I don't... There's not a doubt in my heart, soul, or mind... Which, I only have one of those. I do not have a heart and soul being a robot. There's no doubt in my mind that Terry Bogard, Terrell Terry Bogard, likes Burger King. You're in a good mood today, chat, and that scares me. I feel like you're all plotting something. Let's uh, jump into a ranked match first. Um, oh, in order to assign an initial rank, you battle three CPU opponents in a tutorial battle. Sure. Just like Fortnite. You know, most games are, in fact, like Fortnite. You, um, kill people. Select yeah. So, this is my team as of right now. Yeah, you kill people in this game. It's pretty cool. I would assume you're throwing fireballs. I don't think many people... I wouldn't die to a fireball, but I don't know if most people would. Yeah, my team is like entirely Shoto's because I don't know how to play... I, I don't know how to play King of Fighters. So, it's like, I'll just play the like the most... Intuitive class. Round one. Ready? Go. Oh, I was about to start trying to play this like Street Fighter. I'm gonna be like annoying. Oh, oh, okay. She can reflect that. I didn't know that, and I have her on my team. Okay, I did a confirm, I think. I forget King of Fighters has rolls. I keep trying to grab. Again, chat, I expected to play Street Fighter today. Luckily, I think God willed this to happen. Oh no, Street Fighter 6 isn't working? Too bad. If only there was some kind of alternative 2D platform or 2D fighter that was currently in beta. 
Is Akuma in this game? No, but he will be. I gen I fully believe Akuma will get into this game at some point. They just added like the entirety of. They added the entirety of Samurai Showdown to this game. So, if we ever get any Street Fighter crossover stuff, it's going to be Akuma. I don't think Capcom will rest until Akuma is in every video game. I'm quite not- I'm not sh we need to add John Cena? I agree. Did you guys know that King of Fighters and- or SNK as a whole is owned by the same company that owns WWE now? That company is the Saudi Arabian government. The country of Saudi Arabia owns SNK and the WWE. So if you didn't know that, you know that now. Unfortunate. I don't really know, um... Oh, the WWE 3, uh, the WWE deal didn't go through? That's interesting. They do own SNK, though. Yeah, I don't really know how to chain in this game. Yeah, boobs on screen. Through. My, you know, I feel like Sakurai could have added my to. Sakurai could have added my. He could have done that. I think that was him knowing like the power he had and choosing not to act on it. Like when uh, Shadow uses his ring inhibitor. Sakurai hates women. For legal reasons, is a joke. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. I don't even know most of the uh, inputs for these characters. Uh, what does stream look like, by the way? Are we having any issues on the visual side of stream? Oh, by three CPUs, they mean three individual teams I have to go up again. Okay. It's taking its sweet time. There it is. So Leona seems really cool. I like watching gameplay of them, but they're also a charge character, and they don't play like Guile, which means I don't know how to play them. They're pretty cool. I really like the uh, character design in SNK a lot. Even if sometimes it's just kind of like a guy. SNK is very funny design wise because either they're either like just a normal dude in like a t-shirt 
or like some anime shit. These two ideas just coexist. I accidentally did the auto combo. I can't turn off auto combo. I just died. <laughs> oh my god. Visually, this is a big step up from 14. I don't think it's an unpopular opinion to say 14 was kind of, like, bland, visually. There was a lot to be desired. It was their big first um, foray into doing an actually fully 3D game since doing sprite work had almost made them like god of business. And we're tied up. See you. That new game, the uh, that's an art of fighting game coming out that has Terry in it, right? That's a pretty solid um, mix-up. BP on block into grab mix-up or cross-up. That's a cross-up, not a mix-up. Also, not really cross up. It's just. Is it a cross up? Chat, is it a cross up? I don't remember. Sometimes I just forget what jargon means. So, Kula is a character who I think is very cool, but she also feels like she is far too complicated for me to ever get the hang of. He's got big flashy moves. And I'm dead. Who is going to take the win? Anyone in chat uh, play King of Fighters? Hey, come on. I know there's at least one or two people in chat who I've forced to watch Evo with. Nope. I would say King of Fighters is a very weird series in terms of who plays it. Because I would say, at least in the States, it's more niche than like anime fighters like Blaze Blue, especially now Guilty Gear. But it's also, it still has a really big international audience. Huge in South America, but I think that goes without saying at this point. Everyone knows that. I've played it with a friend with friends a few times, but I've never been particularly good at it. It continuously continues to be a thing that I lack particular skill with. Because King of Fighters is a very execution-heavy game. You aren't just... King of Fighters demands as much from your body as real fighting does. Which I think is a big, huge part of the appeal. I do, really, I do really want to get into King of Fighters more, but there is just the concern that it's a huge time sink to get into King of Fighters. I've had the same feelings about uh, Rivals of Aether, 
because as much as I have fun playing Rivals casually, Rivals is a very hard game to get into. Like, if you choose to play Rivals of Aether, it'll take you, like, years of your life to get good at that. Especially if you're not very good at platform fighters beforehand. Which I'm not. We should get into Melee. I've genuinely considered it. Especially with the uh, 20XX coming out. The co new content. Lucas and Sonic are in it now. And I am a little inclined. Is 20XX just new content, or is this that they're balancing stuff too? Because if mid tiers are more, uh, if mid tiers are more viable in 20XX, I will absolutely get into it because then I can play that. Balancing melee. When I say more balance in melee, I just mean like. You give more bullshit to more characters. This guy is large. Scarily large. Who allowed him to be that big? Oh my god, that's scary. I do not like this guy one bit. Let me know if there's anything going wrong, uh, streamline. Just because we're trying something new for the VOD today, and I don't know if it's going to work. Also, before you ask, no, I do not know how to do my secrets. Well, my DP did not beat that, so... I, may, I think this may be my loss. I think we might be over, Kirby Bros. I know how Terry works, for the most part. I don't know how this guy works, though, like at all. I love Far Knuckle. I love Far Knuckle. Stop doing that. Okay, yeah, it's over for me. Oh my gosh. All eyes are on the winner of that fierce fight. Winner! 
呪うならてめえの不運を呪いな。Rank 12? I don't know if that's good or not. I sure played that video game though. So I guess now is time to actually search for matches. Now here's the question. Will we get any? I don't know. We got one. Select order. Okay, so they're rank 15. I don't know if higher number is a good thing or not. Usually, the closer to rank 1 is good, right? It's about to be a party up in here! Oh, he's like a sand guy. Okay, if you won't let me get in, then I'll play the long game too. Okay, I checked the throw. Pretty good. out by the sands of time pressure in this game is really scary because characters i don't know if if you don't know anything about king of fighters one of the biggest things to know is this game is very execution heavy um both in your move set but also in movement there are like seven different types of jumps you can do and they're all very different That's a full screen projectile that comes out so fast. Okay, pretty good. And that cross up with the DP on block is really good because most players aren't going to expect you to go for a throw. And it puts you behind in the prime spot for it. I like that the game mentions Anchor by name. Like they're in the know, they know what an Anchor is. It feel, it's, it's strange that it feels like a rare thing for games to actually acknowledge their community jargon. You think with fighting games especially they'd be more on top of stuff like that.
Terry's a character I know really well. Just from, like, Cultural Osmosis. He is the Shoto. He's in SNK vs. Capcom, which is a game that I do know, even if I'm not good at it. He's got a DP. He's got a Fireball. What else do you need? Oh, I forgot there's another player I have to fight. Okay, I should have this. Okay, punish with a throw. That's bad, but we can fix it. Maybe we can't fix it. <laughs> Maybe we've gone too far. That was fun. I could have gone. I could have punished that jump in, but I didn't. What a stellar fight! These two know how to rumble. Winner! He's got a Tatsu and a flash kick. Is it a flash kick? I guess we're back to the grind. The UI in this game is very clean. I would like to say they did a very good job with it. And another match already. Select order. They're doing better than Strive has. If it's a charge move that sh sends you upwards, that's a flash kick to me. I'm not the uh, end-all, be-all of fighting game jargon, but to me, that's a flash kick. I think this is a team of all shadows. Oh my god, that's so scary. I love to wake up DP. That was bad. Okay, into a super. Does that kill? It doesn't. But that killed, so... Not much to be lost. Right, this is a command grab. This, uh. Well, I didn't. I didn't. I did really bad, actually. I did the exact opposite of good. Hopefully I'll do better as Ter Terry, but I do not foresee I do not foresee me winning this match. Burn 
Thank you, Barnacle. And hopefully I can just use my basic Shadow Knowledge to uh, respond properly in neutral and not get my ass kicked. But we're going up against Clark, who I've already shown that I do not know how to play against. Punish that with a throw. I expected that. I foresaw that. Ancient Scrolls predicted that and warned me in advance. See, that's what I'm talking about. This basic Shoto knowledge is getting me back in the game. Now, will I win? I'm still not sure. But, I'm doing better. Chris is a wacky character. I see this character a lot. Okay, crazy conversion, or unless that was the auto combo. You can't turn auto combos off. And they're just a thing you can do online. That was a nail biter. Keep an eye on this matchup. Winner. Oh, my rank has been going down. So, okay, the higher the number is, the better the player. So we've got a rematch going. Pretty good. It's 1-0, and I'm probably going to lose again, but this time I'm actually going to, like, try really hard, as if I wasn't trying beforehand. Bigger number, but a person. That's true. Oh, I didn't realize there were air throws in this game. Pretty good to know. Okay, I'm, I'm getting owned. It's okay though. Pretty good reversal punish. Nice. I'm just gonna have this ride Athena into a uh, Clark. Now last time I fought, both times I fought Clark were Terry. So, hopefully they can just carry the character knowledge. He's a big grappler guy. So we're going to be jumping, rather than just blocking. And go for safe jump-ins instead of that. I don't think Athena's gonna make it, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. I like that the announcer has plenty of lines to be, like, situational about it. It's not like Street Fighter VI's live commentator theory, obviously. But, theory. Feature. But it is cool to have, like, a commentator who is actually participating in the game, rather than just saying, round start!
Like, you have this guy talking about... Okay, I've been suplexed. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. We're gonna punish with a throw. Just get him out of here. Do not want to deal with him anymore. Good. Okay. Grapplers are scary, man. I'm not, I'm not fit for this. Okay, so now we're doing with Chris again, which... Difficult. <laughs> we're gonna give you that to Terry, though. Very familiar ground. This is the anchor, though. This is probably whoever they know best. Punish with a DP. I have been punished with DP or a flash kick. That looks way more like a flash kick. I, I love DP. I love DP so much. That was that was that was good. Sometimes I even impress myself. I really didn't expect to be able to punish that, but I, I saw even the slightest window, and I was like, I need to take any opportunity. So that's this one to one, which is better than I expected to be doing. So true, so true. Can we get some applause for for DPs in chat? Any fans of invincible reversals in chat? Okay, strong with the DP. I gotta get into throwing my uh, funny projectiles. Thank you, chat. Love and peace on the planet Earth. Not good. I survived longer than I thought. I can be a very obnoxious zoner. It's fun to do. Yes, I play Peacock and Skull Girls, if you were wondering. Unrelated. There we go. We clean that up. Good job. Good job. Round three. Ready? Go. 
Now again, Quark has a habit of doing a sin. Because man, do throw, do bad. And that's gonna, um... Or not, okay. Okay, they expected us to go around that time. Very good throw cancel on their part. Just barely out of range. Jump in and hit with a low. Nice. I don't think Yuri is going to live more than a second. I think, unfortunately, the reality we're in is that Yuri is going to die very quickly. Yuri's low and the boost from winning that last round will not be enough. Because very clearly, this player knows something about Chris that I don't about any of my characters. I've noticed this player likes to DP with Chris just as much as I like to DP with my characters. I've also noticed he loves to jump in with very heavy, um, long recovery attacks. So if I jump in with lights and uh, meet him mid-air, I'll be able to do better than I am. Yeah, Yuri Nation down. Sorry all Yuri fans in chat. Okay. That was a nail I dislike that auto combos cannot be turned off. I do not mind auto combos. But the fact that auto combos are any additional push of punch or even light punch and heavy punch will just start auto combo. I don't like that. My little my little CPU likes to assert pressure by pressing light punch in places I shouldn't be. This creates a major problem for me when I'm put into situations where I no longer can do that. It's about to be a party Very surprised to see just how quickly we are getting into matches. Very happy about that. Because whenever we stream Strive, it takes a million billion years to play any games. But we've had a lot of, we've had, I mean, we've only had two different players. But we've already been playing for a little while now, haven't we? It's good. It's good. I like it. I'm very glad Crossplay got to this game. Because I know from hearing about people who do play it, it was something it really needed. I love projectiles. Have I mentioned that? Oh, 
I love DPs. Shouts against DPs. I mean, can we get some DPs? Can we get some plaza DPs in chat? This is just a guy in a cave. I can also press auto combo. Okay. <laughs> okay. I felt really tempted to, I'm sorry. I know I've committed sacrilege, but. in the corner. Shit. I, I, I'm dead now. That's what I get for uh, putting on a pressure drive, like, I guess. We're only at Yuri now, though, so I imagine we'll be fine. I can wake up DP too. Um, I don't know what's happening. I'm going to be completely honest. Urination down. Terry versus Terry. We'll be fine. Some auto combo in the corner. What a stellar fight! These two know how to rumble. Winner! Oh, hello. Welcome to chat. <laughs> um... Well, yeah, I did badly there. I've done very poorly, but it's not a big deal. I don't know what I'm doing, which is a good enough excuse as any other. Uh, thanks for the follow, but I don't have the money for any promotion right now. And I also don't trust a website called Doge Hype. But feel free to stay in chat. We are playing uh, for a little bit longer. Dogehype.com. Nothing will stop this show.
Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Dogehype.com. Oh, we're in the training room? I'm probably dead. I'm probably dying. Round one. Ready? Go! I'm on fire. Pretty huge things happening in the Kirby's and Nerd chat today. I'm going to hell, by the way. Okay, teleport into uh, grab is pretty good. Claims to be a teleport. Gets hit by projectiles anyways. Okay. We get we get we love DPs. We love DPs in this household. Oh my god. Yeah, I saw Cronin a lot, I think, at EVO last year. And Cronin is capable of some crazy content. The kind of stuff Cronin can get away with is crazy. Very easily punishable jump in. Gonna punish with a throw. Send out fireballs. Get punished for the DP miss. That's- oh my gosh, that's a wall bounce? <laughs> Yow! It's okay though, we're gonna just go into Terry. And even if we don't take the game, I think we're gonna at least get this match. Or this round. You can loop those if you have enough meter, which is always really scary. Yeah, we're taking Cronin. We have lost a lot of health. Even with that post-round boost, I don't think we're going to make this. Especially since Yori is a character who I'm not very good against. Nice, confirming the super. Hit with a low. Pressure with a fireball. And I died to a stray jump with a pressure a string. Pretty good. This guy is such a dweeb. I am a big I'm a big fan of the UI in this game. It's not anything all too unique, but it's very sleek, it's very effective. I don't think anything about it is particular particularly bad, which is a pretty good thing to have in a fighting game cuz a lot of fighting games just have like very middling UI. It's hard to know where things are. They're definitely going for a big like 
esports kind of a direction, though, visually. With these sleek, like, single dual colored, simple shapes and stuff like that. Emblems. So this is one of the uh, characters who's just from uh, Samurai Showdown, who's in this game. You think this game would be better if it had a really obnoxious lobby system? I think you might have a point. We should make it to where you have to design like a little guy, and then you have to walk around and manually find other players instead of going through a random search. And sometimes those uh, little like places where you make other players just glitch out and you can't actually fight them. I think that would be a really intuitive system. Like sometimes the uh, the arcade machines and the online lobbies just break and you can't play the game. Double KO? Okay. Okay, good jump in. I love DP. It is really easy to pun punish this player with Fireball. Some game plan, yeah. They kept doing they just kept running forward. I didn't need to do anything there. As long as they weren't going to jump over my fireballs, I was going to keep doing them. I accidentally did an auto combo. Like, I, I genuinely mean that was purely an accident. I think they're trying to punish me for being a Smasher. A Masher, sorry, I do not play Smash Brothers. Do not accuse me of such vile acts. That didn't work out for me. Luckily, whatever they tried to do did not confirm. And they're going to keep trying to work, just walk forward at me. Okay. Hit by a low. Pretty basic, and I should have seen it coming. But I didn't. I apologize for my poor neutral play. I don't see this being too difficult, unless they get their shit together very fast. Fireballs are so useful and such a core part of fighting game neutral. You know, you can just control so much of the screen with a fireball. What's the player going to do? Just run forward at you? They're going to get hurt. They're going to die. But it's also really easy to beat a fireball. You can just jump over it, or block it and then move forward, and then block it and move forward. It's a really easy game plan to beat, but it can also be just as strong. Hmm. Pretty cool. I think I'll finish this set, and that might be all I have for tonight. 
because I may not stream for too long today. I want to save my energy to stream for a long while tomorrow. I definitely think their strongest character is probably Darley, but that might just be because this is a character who has huge, scary hitboxes. I love GPs. They really do not know how to do anything about Fireball. As soon as you start projectile pressure, it's just over for this player. Which is which is a shame. I feel a little bad about it. Pretty good strings, pretty good strings. Luckily, I can just press buttons. Any fans of pressing buttons in chat? See, this is a really good game plan because it works. Um, it doesn't work because it's very smart. Not to, not to say that I'm not smart, I'm actually very intelligent. Sometimes fighting games are just about finding the easiest way to cheap out the other player. Okay, barely out of my range. And that's the end of Athena's wrath. Oh my gosh. I have to rely for a while there. Funny flash. I feel like that's an auto combo. I doubt this will be very hard for Terry. They give him a huge buff though. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty cool. GG is clearly someone who's beginning. But I wish them luck in their uh, journey. Because I, too, do not know what I'm doing. I think I've got one more game in me. And then I have to go charge my batteries a little early tonight. Look at that. That's so fast. And these have all been different players, too. <laughs> Block is overhead. 
It may just be because, you know, it is an open beta, so there are going to be going to be a lot more players on it than usual, but I've just been able to get into matches with different people and play them, which is way more than what I've been able to do with Strive, because Strive it takes forever to get into a match, and a lot of the time you have people who you've already played against trying to match you. I imagine this guy is going to be a grappler. Well, there goes the well, there goes the Xena. Oh my God. I think it's possible this guy may not be a grappler. He might just be a pig power class kind of character. There I go. <laughs> Oops. That's see, that is some good fireball etiquette though. They just approach. They would block when the ball was coming in and then continue their approach when it wasn't. They were easily able to close out the distance. Nice. Okay. I don't imagine I'm going to be coming out of this alive, but I do think I can get far with Terry. That's a lot of hit. I expected that. That was a read. Yeah. Okay then. <laughs> I didn't expect him to know such strong combos with this character. No rematch? Well, I will search one more time. Whether this goes 2-0, to 2-1, 1-0, to zero, whatever. I want to play one more game. Ooh. 
Oh gosh. Okay, so Shermy is in the middle. I know Shermy is a grappler. It's one of the things that I know very well about this game. Oh, so we're playing this kind of game. Grab, throw, grab. Nice jumping, nice jumping. Block this overhead. So of course, Shermie's a grappler, so I do not want myself to allow her to get in. I'm just going to keep using my, uh, Psycho... <laughs> psycho Ball? I'm just going to keep using my Psycho Balls until I can keep her out long enough to win. But now that she has me in the corner, I'm a corpse in the ground! <laughs> Oops. It's okay, we still have Yuri. Yuri Nation, let's go. Oh my gosh, enter the super cancel? Okay. Okay, think. Very thankful for the chain. Nice. I do not know what this character's game plan is going to be. Oh, it's that. Goofy ass run cycle. Does a crazy amount of damage. Oh my god. So we're gonna play a completely different game switching to Terry. Which will help to condition someone to be one to, one to be aggressive, one to deal with pressure. But if we're kind of rushed rush down about Terry, then we can just completely throw it off. See? Psychic warfare. It's everything.
And will we get a rematch? <laughs> we won't. Okay. Unfortunate reality, but all things must go on. Is there anything else that we have access to in We have combo trials. I can take a look. A little bit of combo trials never hurt anybody. If I do get into King of Fighters on a more personal level, I do want to actually know how to do combos, anyways. Ready? Go! Okay. Pretty basic stuff. Okay, that's my super. It's hard to fluidly go into the super. Because I have to do a quarter circle again. This is what I've talked about with this being a high execution game. Right now, I think I just want to get, like, an understanding of my character. Hold on. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh, I'm foolish. I was seeing those two buttons and I was reading them as either or and not EX. I'm a little dumb. I don't know that uh, EX looping is a big part of this game. Is this also an EX that I misread? No, it's not. King of Fighters combos, they are something else. They're very particular about when you They're very particular about when you can do these inputs. Very execution heavy game. Well, I accidentally uh, comboed into a super. I don't think accidental super combos are a thing you can find in many other games. Well, I think I've seen all I need to see for today. If King of Fighters is a big one on the channel, I will make a point to stream it more, or get it to stream it more in the first place. But as of now, I am running out of energy, and I need to go charge my batteries, get something to eat, start getting ready for bed. So thank you to everyone who came out today for a stream. It's always a pleasure to, to see every one of you. Even when you're wrapping it up in chat, I swear to God, mods, do something about that. N no more wrapping in chat, I swear. But, personal biases aside, thanks for coming out tonight. I hope you all have a great night. I hope you all have delicious food. Did I win? Not exactly, but, um, it was worth it. Hey, hey, I see that. Hey, 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 hey. Mods, mods. And they're highlighting them. 
They're highlighting the mods. Home mods, please. You're on thin ice. All things put aside, it's getting late. It's time to head to bed. Thanks for coming out tonight. Tomorrow we will be going live again with no more heroes. More no more heroes. We're going to continue where we left off last Friday. On a Saturday. <laughs> um, we're going to be going through ideally three different bosses. We got through ranks 10, 9, and 8. So rank 7, 6, and 5 would be what we'd like to do. But we'll see when we get there. Because I don't want to spend too long. He's coming out. I am so tired. I am so tired. Good night.